Hello, creepy people, and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be doing a very quick, short, and sweet unboxing of the February 2022 Horror Pack unboxing. I literally just finished filming the January unboxing because I am very behind. So in this video, we are just going to be unboxing the February movies and then we will collect and come back together in March for a big review and unboxing of the March movies. So first off, if you guys have no idea what Horror Pack is, Horror Pack is a horror movie subscription service where every month you get four new DVD and or Blu-rays and they are all horror movie genre related. You have no idea what you're going to get. Sometimes you get movies that are amazing cult classics. You love them. You've seen them. It's great. Sometimes you get movies you've never heard of before that do become your new favorites and sometimes you get movies where you're like, what in the name of all that is holy is this shit? That's what keeps it exciting. That's what keeps it fun. And that's why I love doing Horror Pack. So if any of you guys are interested in checking out Horror Pack for yourself, I will have a link right at the top of the description box. But have no fear, even though this is a horror video. <laughs> It is not an affiliate link. I am not making any money off of your clicks. It is simply just a link for you guys to go check out the site and see if it is something that you guys are interested in subscribing to. So with all of that out of the way, let's jump into the February movies. The January pack that I just unboxed looked really good. So let's hope we keep a theme going here and let's hope the same for the February movies. And I'm just going to jump right into it, guys. We're going to keep this really short, sweet, and simple. So I'm going to unbox the package. I have not peeked. I have not looked. And kaboom. Ooh, another slip cover. This is exciting. We love slip covers here on this channel. Again, four new movies. No idea what they are. And we're just going to go ahead and start. I'm going to take the one off of the very bottom. And the first movie for February 2022 is... Ta oh my gosh, I have heard of this movie before. What the fuck? Okay. This one, probably not going to like very much. Let me just take the plastic wrap off here. The first movie is Another Wolf Cop, Dirtier and Terrier. So this movie, I have definitely heard of it before. I have never seen it. But this one looks cheesy and stupid as all get out. Oof, I don't know. Okay, um, <laughs> this was made in 2017. It is about 79 minutes, so a little over an hour long. Um, I'm sure a lot of you guys watching this have seen this movie before, and I'm pretty sure just by looking at it, it's not going to really be my thing. But let's go ahead and read what it says on the back, shall we? So on the back it says, A year has passed since the dark eclipse transformed hard-drinking officer Lou Garu into the infamous Lycanthorpe crime fighter. Although the evil that controlled Woodhaven was defeated, the community is far from returning to normal. A villainous entrepreneur is looking to open a new brewery and revive the local hockey team, but it's clear that he has ulterior motives. With a new mayor and the new chief of police, Wolf Cop has his work cut out for him and he has to save the town all over again. Okay, so what I'm getting from this is that this is possibly a sequel to maybe a f the first Wolf Cop movie. How the hell they got the budget to do a second one, I don't know. Maybe the first one was like mind-blowingly good or something. I really don't know. <laughs> but um, we will have to see. I, uh... I don't know, you guys. Don't really have a lot of high hopes for this. This is probably just going to be cheesy and just not right up my alley, but I could be wrong. I could put this in and I could fall in love with it and I could become a wolf cop stan. You never know with Horror Pack. And that's what, like I said, it keeps it interesting. So that is the first movie that we got for February. Let's go ahead and jump into the second movie. I'm going to take the one off the very bottom again. And the second movie for February 2022 is... Okay, so we have the Horror Pack Limited Edition, which if you do not know, every Horror Pack pack comes with a Horror Pack Limited Edition Blu-ray or DVD or whatever, and basically they're like lower budget kind of B-movies. Yeah, sometimes they're really good and sometimes they're just really awful. So this one is called Morbid Colors. This was made in 2020. It's about 105 minutes, so close to two hours. That's crazy. 
And on the back it says, after returning home from her most recent runaway trip, Micah isn't quite the same. The brash rock and roll drummer's strange behavior is most evident to her foster sister and bandmate, Devin. Following a horrific episode at one of the sisters' concerts, Devin discovers the source behind Micah's new demeanor, an insatiable thirst for human blood. As efforts to battle the affliction continue to fail, the sisters embark on a desperate mission across the American Midwest to save Micah and reverse the curse. Okay, so this one actually sounds really interesting. I'm kind of getting like vampire movie-ish vibes. It's kind of cool. It kind of gives me like a grungy 70s feel. Uh, I don't know. This one could be good. We will have to see. I'm very curious. Hopefully it's not, you know, too cheesy, too boring, too drawn out. So yeah, if you guys are subscribers of Horror Pack, let me know what you thought of Morbid Colors because this one, I don't know. Sounds interesting. Good. All right, guys, we are halfway done. We have two movies left. I'm going to take the one off of the very top this time. We're going to save the slip cover for last. And the third movie for February 2022 is Shut the Fuck Up. Shut Up. Oh my god. Okay, if you guys are watching this directly after my January unboxing, I literally just talked about how I watched this movie and how it creeped me the F out. Well, guess what movie we just got in the February pack? The Vigil. I literally, literally just watched this movie and it creeped me out so bad, but in a good way. I really, really liked this movie and I literally can't believe I now own it. I was, I just talked about this movie in the January pack that I just finished filming. Holy shit. Okay, so for those of you who have not seen it, I will go ahead and go through like everything. So this was made in 2020, 89 minutes long. And on the back it says, a young man agrees to fulfill the ritualistic duties of a shamer and sit in vigil over a dead body. But he soon realizes something is very wrong when he arrives at the dilapidated house. Oh my god. Okay, I'm really excited that I own this because I thoroughly enjoyed this movie so much. I even tweeted about it. That's how serious it was. I tweeted about it right after I watched it. So this is really, really good. It is on Hulu right now, I believe. So definitely go and check it out if you haven't seen it. Loved it. Certified fresh on Rotten Tomatoes, which is always a good sign. This is a Raven Banner film and it's really good. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to like take a picture and send it to my boyfriend because we both enjoyed this movie. That's so crazy. So crazy. Just watched it, just talked about it, and now it's in my hands. Ah! Oh my god, I'm so excited about this. Really good. Okay, I'm excited now. Woo -woo. I was a little worried about this pack at first, but now I'm like, okay. Break it down, break it down. Alrighty guys, we have one movie left and the last movie for the February 2022 pack is the one with the slip cover. And this one is a Gary Oldman film and this one is called Mary. And this movie has the same writer from the movie The Shallows. Love that movie, just watched that a few nights ago. Um, no idea what this movie is gonna be about. So we will have to, I've never heard of it or anything. So Let's see, this was made in 2018. It is about 94 minutes long. David, who is Academy Award winner Gary Oldman, is a struggling blue collar captain looking to make a better life for his family. Strangely drawn to an abandoned ship that is up for auction, David impulsively buys the boat, believing it will be his family's ticket to happiness and prosperity. But soon after they embark on their maiden journey, strange and frightening events begin to terrorize David and his family causing them to turn on one another and doubt their own sanity. With tensions high, the ship drifts off course and it becomes horrifyingly clear, that's the word, that they are being lured into an even greater evil out at sea. Okay, this actually sounds really good, really creepy. I Oh my god, I am so rude. I didn't even show you guys like what the cover art looks like. So here is what this movie looks like looks creepy. It looks really good. So yeah, I have a lot of hopes for this one. Very, very excited. 
And I love the fact that Gary Oldman is in it. That kind of gives you, you know, a good a good sign that it's going to be a good movie. So I'm very excited. I think this one's going to be really good. Have you guys ever seen this? Like, is it good? Is it not? Like, holla at your girl. Okay, guys. So those were all of the movies that we got for the February 2022 unboxing. I'm really excited. I think we have some okay movies in here. Really excited about these two right here, Mary and The Vigil. The horror pack, I think it's going to be pretty okay. This one, I really don't have a lot of high hopes for, but of course, as always, I will take one for the team, and I will watch all of these movies, even this one. I will take my little notes in my little horror pack notebook, and I will report back to you guys next month on what I think of these movies. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. As always, if you did enjoy and you are a horror movie fan like myself, make sure you go down and give this video a huge thumbs up. I would greatly appreciate it. Also, if you are new to my channel, make sure you go down and hit that red subscribe button. I do upload every three to four days here. But as the rest of you, I love you guys so very much. As always, make sure to stay creepy and I will see you all very soon in my next video. I love you guys. Bye. Oh my gosh, I have so many movies to watch. Like, look at this. I have to watch all of these now. All these movies. I'm gonna be busy. I better get to work. Okay, love you, bye.